The elf was Kunari. And the dwarf has no beard. I know it made no sense to me either. Maybe they cut her horns off. The Kunari are not a race. They are a religion. What I don't understand is why a Kunari agent would try to kill one of her own people. And why involve the champion? Excellent questions. I expect answers to match. I live to please. I have a question. When the Duke told you what I was, you said you didn't care. Was that true? I would have said he couldn't compare to your awesomeness, but that might have seemed petty. I am sorry. This didn't work out like I'd planned. Obviously. What was your plan, exactly? The one I expected to find is named Salit, a member of the Ben Hasrath, the heart of the many. I was told he's here to sell secrets to the Orlesians, and I came to stop him. I... Suppose I was misinformed. So you came here to stop this Salit from betraying your people? You probably won't believe me, but this isn't a political mission. It's... personal. What do you mean? Salit was my best Rathari, the one who recruited me into the Ben Hasrith. My tutor. He's the one who saw my potential, convinced me that I could make a difference. It doesn't matter now. But you said he was selling secrets. He is. Or at least he intends to. One last act of defiance. I can't let him do that. Not when he'll hurt so many others in the process. You mean, he'll hurt other Kunari? Not every Kunari is a soldier, you know. There are tens of thousands of farmers, artisans, craftsmen. People who have never hurt anyone. People whose only crime is living. They don't deserve what he's going to do to them. But it's more than my duty to stop Salit. It is my moral obligation. You mentioned the heart of the many before, but you said it was the name of the jewel. It's also what Ben Hasrith means. Some people say we're enforcers that keep the Kunari in line, but that's not it. It's hard to explain. Try. We're the soul of the Kune. We keep its spirit alive and protect it from both outside and from within. Not every Kunari agrees, nor do they always do what is best for all. The Ben Hasrith remind us of our common goal. You make them seem almost peaceful. It's not always meant to end in violence. There are other paths. They do not all need to lead to the same destination. I probably don't sound very convincing. The way you're talking, it sounds like you're one of these Ben Hasrath. I am, or I was. Whether I ever am again, I guess that remains to be seen. Is that why you're here? To redeem yourself? Not to them. Doubt is the path one walks to reach faith. To leave the path is to embrace blindness and abandon hope. Another Kunari proverb? She who swallows wisdom in tiny chunks avoids choking. So did you really involve me just because I had an invitation? You were the only one on the invitation list who wasn't a personal friend of the Montfort family. And you're also the champion of Kirkwall, and a Ferelden with no reason to love Orlay. And what was going to happen when all this was over? I thank you, we go our separate ways. So I just fell off the Ferelden turnip cart, is that it? Truth? You're... Not exactly what I was expecting. I've heard a few stories about you. They don't quite do you justice. Perhaps if I'd done my homework, I would have known more about you. Given you the respect you deserve. Nothing I could do about it now. So everything you told me was a lie? Not everything. So I just missed the part where you're one of the people I drove out of Kirkwall. 
You don't need horns to embrace the Kune. What you need is a purpose, a belief in unity, in improving the lot, not only for your own people, but for everyone. You sound like you actually believe that. I do. Nobody is controlling my mind. I'm not insane. Being Kunari doesn't automatically mean you're a zealot. Most Kunari don't even understand humans, why you act like you do. But I grew up among you. I understand perfectly well. Wait, aren't you here to kill someone for the Kunari? I never said I was killing him for the Kunari. So you're improving his lodge, perhaps repeatedly? I know it's not easy to understand. After what the Aeroshock did, I hardly blame you. But just tell me, can you honestly say there's nothing to improve, nothing to strive for? We believe in striving together. We may stumble, but that doesn't mean we shouldn't try. I'm not arguing about this. It's who I am. I joined the Ben Hasfras because I felt it meant something. M means something. You sound like you're trying to convince yourself. It's been a long time since I talked to anyone about it. I suppose it's not really a prison cell conversation. I assume you have some sort of plan. I always have a plan. A good one? Oh, ye of little faith. <sighs> The first order of business is getting out of here before His Grace decides we would taste good in the soup. Or whatever he has planned. Any ideas? Oh, I'm sure the others will be along any minute now. Bloody run around twisted shite of a maze. Ooh, you've learned a few new words. Wardens get called a few. Undeservedly, I'm sure. Ah, <sighs> that's it. I'm officially tired of waiting to be rescued. Why didn't you just do that before? You said your friends were coming. And you're fine. Of course you are. Let's go. So, back through the castle then. There's a better way than fighting through the Duke's entire army. I'll show you. Well... We found all your gear, at least. Then we should head for the caves. That's the way out I planned to take us through, originally. What exactly did she unlock to Unless open that door? you want to carve your way out through the Duke's army. We'll see. It's up to you which way you want to go, Hawk. I'll help you either way. Make us save me. All set. I'll die in this place. And Droste bless you. Okay, so Talus is Kunari now. It established uh, that they take converts to their religion. And um, Cassandra made a mention that it's a religion, not a race. But you generally don't think of a small elf when you're thinking of Kunari. You think of a gigantic, horned, somewhat blue fellow that likes to smash things with an axe or a hammer. So comes a little bit of a shock to find out that this is an example of what a Kunari can be. Now she does make mention that that they can't that they're not all soldiers, and that makes perfect sense. The entire civilization of nothing but soldiers can't exist. That doesn't even that that would not work at all. It's like there are like Klingons is the the whole concept of a civilization full of nothing but warriors doesn't make sense because there's nothing to support it. There's no farming, there's no infrastructure or anything like that to support just a pure military state. Now, um, it seems like Talos here is caught between two sides, what, what the Kunari represent, and that's sort of like a unity, and what exists in the rest of human societies. Now, she's been a part of both and she seems to have some sort of doubts over whether the Kuhn is the, the best thing, but maybe she considers at least better than the society that she came out of, human society. And remember, she's an elf, so she probably didn't have that great of a time living among humans. 
we've seen plenty of uh, elves, at least, uh, running off towards the Kuhn when, when um, they were inside Kirkwall. Not even anything in here. Should I go up the stairs? Or should I... Ah, shit. Time to kill. between the walls. I don't like these statues. It's like they're staring at me. What the hell is this? I guess I did have an option of either sneaking out of here or not, but I was drawn over here by these quest markers. So, you know. Hey, painting. I think that's enough. I wonder. I wouldn't be the first warden to have a portrait done. Oh. We'll probably never know how this came to be here. Look at this, Hawk. I think these are landmarks scratched on the back. A map of some sort. And just like the armor I have, it just doesn't have any boost to it. This got everything from the chateau the way those rocks look I don't want to test this path more than once guess maybe I should check to see if there's anything at those stairs I can go and go and do uh, I probably won't ever be able to get back into this place so if I miss anything I'll be gone for good is that a sword stuck in a big cheese wheel that's weird Shit, I don't know which way to go. Decisions, decisions, decisions. I'll go through the underground way. I'm gonna assume that that, uh... That this other way is... I don't know if it's safer or better or whatever. Well, let's go. I don't know if it's the same environment or not. But it looks similar to the caves that we get into and sometimes underneath of the More of coast. These well, at least they fled, but that probably means there's more coming. This has to be the place the directions were leading us to. <laughs> Stupid little impish monsters. Oh. 
lost cursor again. So I think the fight's over. Weird little freaks. Always check the corners. These little things aren't that big of a threat. I guess if there's enough of them, they can cause a problem, though. Why do they have money? Okay, I guess it's everything in the cave. Let's move on. Okay, so he can talk. <laughs> What's he talking about a mage? Was I mean Bethany was here, but ah, uh, whatever. Oh, there are a bunch of mages. That's what he's talking about. He has a bunch of mages working for him. How the hell did he do that? I mean, he's got him. Uh, he's got. Uh, him under his control somehow. Okay, we got a little bit more backup. He's got more too as well though. Ah, that one's got longer health bars. We'll be alright. Good move with Bethany throwing that AoE attack in the bridge. <laughs> Bright. Okay, I got some new uh, weapons. Not for uh, not for Hawk though. Sting, huh? And nothing does more base damage though. 
what I already have. Oh, 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 look at that. Whatever dragon's uh, dragon's breath and superior maul. Higher base damage versus I mean I just want to see what this looks like. Oh, look at that. That looks awesome. That looks ridiculous. <laughs> Why didn't you just open that up rather than going around? Are you testing me? That's so cute. Do you know what I said or not? Struggle is an illusion. There is nothing to struggle against. But your accent is terrible. Ugh. Remember that um, Fenris is from Terventer. And Terventer has spent all of its time, um, recent, recently anyway, the past few hundred years, in almost constant wars with the Kunari. So I guess it makes sense that he knows a little bit of their language. And he may, even if he's not terribly fond of Terventer, not be fond of the Kunari at the same time. Even if they are fighting against people that he hates so much. Monsters are going to come out of that, aren't there? I'll go this way. There, an exit. Ah, oh, here we go. And there's the way out. See? I told you I had a plan. It was a good plan. The kind that had an escape and everything. Not a monster there. That is a good sign. So, you could go. There are, however, other options. Coming on a bit strong there, Talus. We've only just met. But we've been through so much together. Wyvern hunts, betrayals, daring escapes from prison. <laughs> You're right. I'm feeling so close to you right now. <laughs> so, it's true what they say about you. You've been so reasonable since we were captured. I'm hoping that hasn't changed. What Salit is going to do will harm so many innocents. My people, as well as yours. It's my duty to stop him. Even so, I can't do it alone. Not anymore. Explain what's so terrible about Salit's plan. I can't. Not completely. And yes, I know. That's a hard sell. The information Salit plans to turn over to Orle won't just hurt Kinari, however. It will harm anyone living in Kinari lands. Even those who fled the Kinari of any race will be condemned to persecution forever. It couldn't just be a way to convince me to help you again, I suppose. If only it was. I'm not here on some directive from the Kuhn. I came... Salif was declared Talvishan, but they didn't deem intervention worthwhile. I... couldn't agree. I had to try. Doesn't that make you Talvishan as well? No. The Ben Hasrath didn't order me not to do this, but here I am anyway. <laughs> I was trying to earn my way back into their good graces. This probably won't help. Why? What did you do? It's not easy being an elf in the Kuhn. You're not born to it like they are. I've struggled to find that peace, that certainty. I know it's there. I just keep falling short. What about you? Have you ever been a part of something bigger than just yourself? I protect Kirkwall. Or is that not what you mean? It's not the same thing. The Kunari have a vision of what life should be like. Free from pain and fear and doubt. You see tyranny, and I see caring and interest in the welfare of all. Yes, it could be better. But so could human indifference and cruelty. Or... 
do you disagree? This probably isn't the place for a debate. True. Does that mean you'll help me? What did you have in mind, exactly? Well, we could go back, maybe have some tea with the Duke, get to know one another. Then, just as he starts to trust us, you slip a bag over his head, and we drag him to Antiva. No, not Antiva, you fiend. Or, we could find out when Salita's arriving, and stop him before it's too late. You don't actually think you can finish your mission? Alone? Probably not. But that doesn't mean I shouldn't try. Some things are worth dying for. After everything you've already done, why would I help you again? Because... I've got your nose. The Kuhn taught you that? If I were following the Kuhn, I would actually have your nose. I suppose that doesn't help. If I had my way, you would never have been this involved in the first place. You know how to argue, but my options are... Follow or don't. It's pretty much that simple. I get the feeling you're an exceptional person, Hawk. Here's your chance to prove it. Okay, let's uh gotten this far. Might as well see this to its end. Alright, moving on. Stuck up on geometry. Oh. Oh, okay. Here's where I get my choice. I can leave or join Talus. Let's go with her. Thank you, Hawk. I... Thank you. 